iRobot is in the consumer robotics space. We are offloading a lot of tasks that people may not want to do, floor care and most recently lawn care as well. And we view our role as taking on those tasks and allowing people to live their lives and giving time back to people. In 2015, we launched our first connected Roomba. And we launched that with a full solution IoT cloud provider. But even before launch, we had realized that that provider was not going to scale to Roomba volumes. By the time we were launching, we would realized that sort of the smart home was an integral part of what we were trying to do. We knew already that we wanted to build that application on AWS. This was 2015, and we looked at the suite of managed services that were then available and said, we think we can build this without running any servers. After we shifted to AWS IoT, that really started to become these large-scale days where we were highly worried. They almost became non-events. Our latest Roomba and Brava robots uh, feature imprint smart mapping, which is integral to that smart home user experience. So once it's connected, you can start collecting some usage statistics to see you know, what the average square footage is. Is your battery big enough? If it's too small, then you can make it bigger so that your users are happier if it's too big. You can make the battery smaller and the product less expensive. As iRobot evolves over the years, we're going to see a plethora of robots in the home. Multiple robots working together, um, teaming and sharing data and information, and really starting to enable that smart home experience. And we view our role in the smart home as one that provides trust, one that provides security, one that provides privacy, and at the same time, one that provides flexibility. AWS enables iRobot to focus on building the future of the smart home. The developers aren't bogged down in creating technology to enable them to deliver business value. They're just working in, how do I create a feature and, and ship it? AWS has some of the best cloud technology out there, um, and we continue to push the boundaries with AWS, and they enable us to be able to do so.